Hello, this is Seth Lehaw with American Semiconductor. In this video, we will show you how to use our new Flex NFC Starter Kit. Each kit contains three Flex NFC FHE systems, five Flex NFC flexible ICs, and six Flex NFC aluminum antenna inlays. In this video, we will be showing you how to program the Flex NFC FHE Starter System, test the functionality of the Flex NFC FHE System, and then reset it to the not programmed state. The Flex NFC FHE starter systems are delivered in the N slash P not programmed state. This means that they are ready for you to program over NFC. To begin programming, you will need the NHS31XX downloader app found on the Google Play Store, as well as a bin file of your program. These bin files are created in NXP's LPC Expresso IDE but a few have been provided for you on ASI's Flex NFC Starter Kit website. On starting the NHS31XX downloader app, swipe over to the Select File tab and select a file using either your phone's internal storage or recently used files. After you have selected your bin file, the app will move to the programming screen. Place your phone's NFC antenna over the Flex NFC FHE. Once the tag begins programming, do not move the phone as it will interrupt the programming process. If the NHS31XX app says an error occurred after delivering the last packet, this is normal functionality and it is unknown why this happens. The tag should still be fine. After programming has finished, scan the tag to ensure that the tag is functioning as expected. To set the Flex NFC FHE starter system back to its N slash P not programmed state, you will need an LPC Link 2, an NFC enabled smartphone, and a header to connect to the 10 pin ZIF connector on the Flex NFC FHE. See the starter kit user guide for instructions on how to make one of these headers for yourself. Connect the LPC Link 2 to your PC over USB. Wait about 30 seconds for the computer to install any necessary drivers and then open the Flash Magic program. In the Flash Magic program, set up the parameters as seen here. For the firmware, select the app closed NFC program loader.hex file provided on the Flex NFC Starter Kit website. Connect the header to the J7 port of the LPC Link 2 and plug the Flex NFC FHE into the header's ZIF connector. When you are ready to program, scan the tag with your NFC enabled smartphone and then quickly press the start button in Flash Magic. This will reset the tag in order to put it in a state to accept programming over the ZIF connector. Once the tag has finished programming, remove the tag from the ZIF connector and scan the tag with an NFC enabled smartphone. An N slash P message should appear, indicating the device is not programmed. The tag should now be in a state ready to accept programming over NFC. Thank you for watching our introduction into the Flex NFC FHE starter system. For more information, please visit our website at www.americansemi.com or for additional assistance, email us at support at